this video we will write work in the widget go and we will start working on the ui okay so in here we will remove that container and we will write scaffold okay write in the scaffold body body will be container okay write in the container there will be a decoration we will do box decoration okay it's fine in here now write in there image decoration image okay here we go scroll it down first now write in the decoration image there will be image again okay as your image there we go and write in the asset image we will write the name of an image with that we will use so first we will go right at the desktop as you guys can see in here that asset zip file we will extract that here and now we will provide this in the resource you guys can easily download it from there there we go with the asset folder as you guys can see we will simply drag and drop this right in this image to text convert or get x ok refactor there we go with the asset folder as you guys can see in here here is the images one two three four ok now right in this in the asset image we will use that image back dot jpg ok in here write it assets slash and then back dot jpg ok the name must be same now we will fit it box fit ok dot cover this fine in here ok now we go put the comma in here right after this box decoration we will have that child in here and there there will be a column widget ok and right in the column there will be children and right in the children first we will set the size box ok to give some width 100 is fine and now in here will be another container just for showing the result ok there we go right in the container first we will set the height and in height we will set it to 280 and after the width set it to 250 okay and right after we will set the margin edge and sec as usual we will go with the only top and we will set it to 70 as you guys can see right after this we will do some padding okay edge and sec we will give the left to 28 now right now go down set it to 5 ok and then right set it to 18 this one in here scroll down so right after this in here there will be a child and in child we will have that single child scroll view ok there we go now right in there child and then child will be appearing ok again add in sec in here this time it will be for all and we will set it to 12 right after this again child and this child will be text and then text there will be a result ok scroll it down now Right after the result, we will do some style, okay? Text style. Set the font size to 16. And right after this, text the line. Text the line. We'll go to justify, okay? As you guys can see in here now right after this single child school view we will do decoration 
box preparation. Image decoration image okay. Add in the decoration image image again and asset image now and there we will have another image. Let me show you add in the asset folder in here that one node.jpg in here you will add it okay. My name must be same on jpg that's fine okay now we will fit it box fit we'll go with the core one go in here scroll it down so now right after this container in here you'll have another container okay First set the margin, page and sec, top, RB20, and right, will be 140. Right after this, will be child, and right in the child will be stake. Okay, stake will be children, right in the children will be again stake. Okay, and right in the stake. They will be again children. So now right in there, there will be a center. Okay. Scroll it down first. Now right in the center, there will be child, and in child, there will be an image dot asset. Okay. Now right in there, you will have that image. Let me show you in here that pin dot. PNG okay you will use that in here so write asset slash and then write the name pin dot png okay look out for the name it will be same and right after we will set the height height will be 240 right after the width same 240 okay now right after this take first put comma and in here it will be center ok and in center it will be child and in child will be text button ok now it will be on price ok as you guys can see now now right in the on press it will be a function a pick image from a gallery there one ok we go on now right after this in here we will be on a long press on long press we will go with the camera okay so right in here call upon the camera function in here let's go down first now right in the on long press call upon the camera okay that second one call it's fine in here right after it will be child as you guys can see and the child will be a container okay it will be margin set it as in sec we will go with the only set the top to let's say 25 it's fine in here now it will be child again and not in the child it will be image not equal to no in that case we will do something so if and write in the if we will say image capital I okay dot file and write in there image I'll check comma width we will give it to 140 height we will give it to 190 and right after this height there will be a fit as you guys can see box fit we will go with the fill one ok so right after now 
in here else it will be container ok and right in the container first we will set the width width will be little bit to 40 and height will be 200 ok right after there will be child and right in the child there will be the icon ok icons we will go with the camera underscore we will go with the sharp one camera and how sharp ok it's fine in here and now we will give it size size will be 100 it's fine in here let's give the color now to make it cool colors we will go with the gray one ok it's fine in here let's call it down now we will add the const modifier ok simply test the application ok come here and click on this play button So there is an error as you guys can see and the error they say can run with the sound null safety because it don't support the null safety ok so package firebase ml vision image picker now right in the postpack.yaml as you guys can see in here we will simply go to the pub.dev and let me show you there there is a no upgrade version for the firebase ml vision so let me show you that in the pub.dev ok so open the google chrome and search for pub.dev as you guys can see here pub.dev just search for this ok and here search for firebase ml region as you guys can see here there we go firebase ml region discontinued ok and there's the last version of a firebase ml widget but it didn't support the null safety as you guys can see in here ok go to the android studio and in here we will close that ok close this postpack.yaml now we will open the terminal i will simply paste in here that photo run no sound null safety just write this and then press enter This will take some time, just wait. As you guys can see the result in here ok so now simply go to the google room and search for some images ok as you guys can see in here now we will capture the image long press on this camera icon in here ok 
Here we go with the camera. Okay. You simply capture the image. As you guys can see the result in here, okay? Stay hungry, stay foolish, stay jobs and all these things, okay? So it's working totally fine with the camera. Let's do it for another image in here. We will go with this one. Okay. Now again long press on the camera icon right in here. There we go. Capture the image. Click. As you guys can see the result. The quote in here. If today were the last day of my life, would I want to do what I'm about to do today? Okay, Steve Jobs. So it's working totally fine with the camera. Now we will check it with the gallery. Okay. So now, right on this camera icon in here, just press or click. You will go to the gallery. Okay. As you guys can see here, now I'm in the gallery. And in here there is a, that image. And there is a quote on it. Life is like a riding bicycle. To keep your balance, you just keep moving. I understand okay so it's working also totally fine with the gallery and that's it for this project